Hey guys, this is KingsRevito here and welcome back to my player career mode and uh, we'll start off uh, at the end of the first season here as, as you can see we just got player of the season and player of the year and let's end the season off right now so as you can see right here we completed all our objectives the manager has set for us we uh, achieved the average match rating we got uh, more than 8 goals we got more than 5 assists and uh, we got more than 13% uh, goal to shot conversion rate and yeah and our overall is 787 which is really good in just one season so this is the training I set for my player and let's hope for a good result so we get 3 C's, 1 D and 1 B so these are my trainings again I set for this week let's hope for a good result this time this time we get better results 2 D's, 2 B's and 1 A so now we're into the transfer window and we're in the, into our friendly season and our friendly game will our first friendly game will play against Colorado Rapids so let's start the game against Colorado Rapids nice through ball to Jackson let's go come on let's do some work here oh Bradley just gives it up easily to the back Shoot that! What a goal! What a beautiful goal that was! And we assisted that! Oh my goodness! Was that Mark Blue? Holy hell! Look at that assist! Hantari steals it, I ask for the ball, I cross as soon as I get it, Mark Bloom controls with his chest. Shoots it from outside the box and that Tumbo managed to find the back of the net. Oh my goodness. Wow. Don't get that. Okay. Nice save from Bono. Keeps us in the game. And this team had it's not playing really good. Other than that one goal. Look at that goal kick. What was that for a goal kick? What is what is he doing? Okay. That's full time. I'm not really happy with this game, even though we we made a banger of an assist. That assist was so good. Our best assist probably we ever did. But still the game in overall was a horrible game. And our keeper actually gets man of the match with five as saves. So for the next game, the manager has uh, picked me to play against Santos. So let's kick off this game against Santos and hope for a win. Nice steal from us. And uh, the ball gets stolen off from us again and I think we're injured. It's almost half time. I probably had like two touches to the ball. Two small touches. Oh my goodness, this team. No! Oh my goodness, no, why'd you pass it? Nice steal from us right here. But we don't have any stamina left in, in, in us. To give the ball to Bradley. Bradley gets it. Oh my goodness. This is what our team is doing, just ruining our chances. Come on. Bradley could have easily did something by himself right there. The shot, oh my goodness, it just goes wide, and we can't find our goal way right here. So we get subbed off in the 87th minute, and let's just hope that we still manage to win this. So this is the training I set for my player, and let's hope I get a good, good result. We get an average result this time, everything except our fourth training, we got a C. And here we have a match against Cruz Azul. Man just picked us to play, but it's a friendly. I don't want to play this game, so I'm just going to sim it. So after we sim the game, we ended up drawing 1-1. One, one, and now we go into the semi-final against Monocrest or whatever that team is. So the manager has picked us to play this game. And I, I want to sim, uh, sim this game as well. 
So we ended up drawing nil no, I guess we won on penalties. And that's why we're going in the finals against the same team. Yeah. And I'll play that game. So this is the training I set for my player and let's hope we get a good result. And we get we don't we get the, pretty much the same result as last time. All C's except for our fourth training. And now here's the finals against Santos, the team we just played in, Drew. So we kick off the final in the snow and let's hope for the win. Oh my goodness, we almost conceded right there. Wow. And to be honest, I don't think we're going to win this game. I don't think we're going to win this final. Oh my goodness, Warner took a shot. And that's half time, and it's still nil nil. And yeah, I don't think we're going to win this game. Halfway through the Invitational Cup final, and we're ready to go now for the second period. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Now you can cross it. Can he do it? Get the shot with the post, and there, our own goal. Hits off the post, hits the keeper's back, and finally. We scored, and honestly, that was all just me right there. This time, I, I didn't trust my teammates to do anything for me. I just took it in all by myself. But how that ball just hit back and hit the keeper's back and went back into the back of the net. But just lucky in our part. We have the ball again, we're on a breakaway right here. Knights dodge the defenders. We cut in the box. And we get tripped in the f box and there's no foul. Nice through ball, we're out in the open. Take a big shot, it doesn't work out, but we get a throw in. But oh, what kind of shot was that? That's full time. We ended up winning the game. It's all from a fluky goal from us. So that's the table. And the Invitation Cup, we beat the semi final teams 4 um, 3 on penalties. Santos beat the other team 3 0 in the semi final. And we beat Santos 1 0 and took the cup. So, this is the training I set for my player. Let's hope we get a good result. We get some of, the, of a good result this time 2 C's, 2 D's, and 1 A. So, we're in the transfer deadline day. And surprisingly, no team has offered for me yet. I don't know, maybe it's just because uh, it's the winter transfer window. No one really wants to make an offer yet. Or maybe it's just too early on my season, I don't know. But I'll, I think I'll just stay with TSC for one more season maybe. Depends what offer I get. And it looks like we sold Bendik for 850000 So yeah, I guess Bono will be our starting keeper from now on. So we get an offer from Manchester City. And they're, they're, willing, us, they're willing to pay us 140000 per week. Let's just look at the offer. I don't know like I do want to accept it but I feel like I should stay as just another season with uh, Toronto FC and maybe hope for a better offer I know Manchester City is a good team but I feel like they already have like Aguero and everyone so but I know Aguero is injury prone and anything but they still have a lot of strikers, so I'm just gonna reject their offer. So it's come to the last hour, and it looked like any other teams are gonna come and offer for me, and it doesn't look like TFC gonna buy anyone else. So I'll just end it right here. Here are the, the, my new league expectations from the manager for me. Uh, they want us to get an 8.4 or better um, overall rating. They want us to score 18 goals this season. 
we scored 20 last season. Um, they want to uh, make six assists. I, think, I believe we scored, uh, we made nine assists last season. And they want us to have a 29% goal to shot conversion rate. And I believe we had 30% goal to shot conversion rate last season. So I believe all this is possible. But yeah, it could be a bit harder now. So these are turns I set for my player. Let's hope for a good result. So we failed on our possession training. We got two Ds and two Bs. So since we won't be uh, having uh, playing any games until March, I'm just gonna show you uh, our trainings. And yeah, so this time we got uh, we failed our headers and volleys. We got two Cs, one D, and one A. This time we got bad training this week. We got one C and then restore all Ds. This time we got better training, two Cs, two Bs, and one D. This time we got better training. 2 D's, 2 B's, and 1 C. So now we get news that Giovinco is out for 3 weeks. And that just... It's a blowout for our substitute striker now. It looks like the thing out the door might be... Uh, replacing us from now on. For just 3 weeks. So for this month, my manager wants us to get an average of... Uh, rating of 9. Wants us to score 4 goals. Uh, maintain a goal conversion rate of 60% and make at least two assists for the, all in this month. And uh, yep, so our first game will be against Real Salt Lake. And on that note, that marks the end of the episode. If you guys liked it, please give it a big like, subscribe if you haven't, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>